Soldier's room unchanged a hundred years after his death in World War I. Daniel Fabra recently purchased a home in France with a very special stipulation that accompanied the deed. Typically, when you purchase a home, the previous owners will have completely cleaned out their belongings and given you a new space to fill. That's not the case at all with Daniel's new home, and he plans to keep it that way. In fact, this room has been kept this way for over a hundred years since the day they purchased the home. It's quite a unique story. Before we begin, make sure to smash that like button, subscribe to our channel, and click the notification bell for more amazing videos. Hubert Rochereau was a second lieutenant for the French Army during World War I. He left home for war and his parents left his room alone, so it would be the way he left it upon his return. Hubert was killed from wounds inflicted in battle in Belgium on April 26, 1918. His parents were obviously devastated and sold the home in 1936 with a special clause in the deed. The soldier's bedroom must remain exactly the way it was for 500 years. So far, it's been almost an entire century, and the bedroom has been left exactly as it was the day 2nd Lieutenant Hubert left for war. The bedroom is still full of all his possessions. His military jackets have holes for moths and have been tattered over the years. His desk is still covered with his military paperwork and personal pictures. There's even an untouched gun collection. The current owner of the home has done some research and has found that there's no legal basis binding him from keeping the room that way. He does respect the history and memory of this veteran and plans to keep the room the same. There have been two previous owners who have felt the same way and have kept the room perfectly intact. The room is a part of history that's been perfectly preserved in its original state. It's an honorable tribute to Second Lieutenant Hubert Rochereau, who also has his name listed on a monument in Le Bourne, France, where his regiment was based. He was also awarded the Legion of Honor for his bravery after he was killed in war.